Now, luckily for us, Jerry says we're in for a cool down. Uh, that's on the way this week. And I tell you what, do you really need a study to really say? That it makes it a little hot weather makes you cranky yeah. because you're uncomfortable. Yes. You're just, you just uncomfortable. Can't, you just you can't don't cool feel down. Right, right, right. Yeah, so the middle of the road, 70s, 60s, you know, yeah. maybe some 80s in there. Happier, or, nice yeah. breeze. Yeah, so you're gonna you're already in a great mood, so you're gonna be in right. an exceptionally great mood later this week. Oh, with a well, cool great. down coming. Yes, we're 90 right now. It is uncomfortable outside. A little bit of a breeze helping us along. We are gonna see some showers coming on through in the next couple of days that will also help cool things down. And eventually, once the cold front slides on by by Thursday morning. That's when we'll begin to see that wholesale change in the air just in time for your weekend. We are looking again at mainly clear skies right now. A couple of fair weather clouds out there. There are some showers and thunderstorms well to the west of I-75 of little consequence in central Ohio's forecast. Temperatures this evening though again right at the 90 mark at 5 p.m. We're going to fall down into the 80s into the 70s and that slow temperature slide will really slow down by tomorrow morning waking up to around 70. Very warm, very humid, but it was to set. We are going to be tracking some of those showers which are going to help begin to move things in the right direction. The other thing going in the right direction is the humidity. You're really watching those temperatures dropping a bit. Much more comfortable as we get into Saturday, Sunday, Monday and Tuesday of next week. And it doesn't look like even with temperatures with a bit of moderation in the 10 day forecast are not going to be back in the 90s anytime soon. Here's your forecast with a broad brush for tomorrow. Muggy to start with some sun. A couple of showers and perhaps a rumble of thunder as we go through the late morning through the mid afternoon hours. Temperatures reaching the mid to upper 80s. The peak temperature will be in between there at about 87 degrees. So let's break it down uh, town by town, hour by hour for your Wednesday. Morning we're dry, midday we're dry. A couple of showers popping up early afternoon through the late afternoon, right around 3 to 4 p.m. That's a main line coming on through. I'm not expecting severe weather to be widespread with this system, but some gusty winds not out of the question as this line moves through. It's got a lot of energy to work with. It's been nearly 12, 13 days for some of us without seeing measurable precipitation, so we are due. That line passes by Wednesday evening, and Thursday will tee it up for you, starting off dry, not quite as warm or as humid, a little breezy with some clouds on Thursday, pop-up showers here and there, an outside shot at a rumble of thunder, but I think your afternoon and your evening plans are going to be fine, albeit a little cooler and a little breezy. And now we're going to carry into the weekend. In fact, by Friday evening, I do think we'll see a pleasant condition setting up for Friday night football. 75 at 5 p.m., 7 o'clock at uh, kickoff, 72, and then cooling off and keeping it dry with some clear skies by 9 p.m., 66. Here's the details in your 10-day forecast. Scattered showers Wednesday and storms into Thursday. Friday, we're dry. Saturday, Sunday, looking really nice for your college game. Again, the Bucks start their uh, home opener the season at noon at the shoe on Saturday, Sunday, 77, Monday, 80. And again, even a bit of moderation next Tuesday, Wednesday, upper 70s, that's still right where Temperatures should be this time of the year. Another slight cool down expected by next Thursday and Friday. All right, not a bad forecast. Thank you, Jerry.